I constantly am seeing this comment uh, in my videos, so I just thought I should address it. When is VST3 coming to reason? The real answer is I don't know. But why would I make videos on the internet if I wasn't also going to just baselessly speculate on things? All right, I'm not trying to troll anyone here. I don't have any special knowledge, but I'm wondering, maybe we'll see VST3 in reason next month. Now, why do I think this? Well, I've got two kind of ideas behind this, and maybe I'm totally wrong, and if I am, leave them in the comments. But the first is that Reason 12 was released a year ago in September. So, you know, you'd think what better way to celebrate one year of Reason 12 than by launching a feature that was promised at the beginning of Reason 12. Seems like a pretty good reason to do it for me, um, right? Actually give something people something to celebrate. Seems to me like they should have been working on VST3 for years. Basically, from the moment they implemented VST2, I don't understand how their thoughts weren't, oh, well, this is step one. Now let's finish this process. Um, especially because now VST3 is actually starting to be replaced with an even newer language for plugins. So we'll see. Um, but another reason is that in June, they released a update to their roadmap. And what they said is that now that they finally have gotten Reason 12 up to the quality standards they would have liked, which took them until about April, they can now start focusing on VST3 full time, full throttle, to quote them. Uh, and they say that actually they can already load and play VST3 effects, but there's a lot of refinements. They're expecting it to reach our hands by the end of the year. You know, they've been kicking the can down the road so much that I'm hopeful that maybe this is like now them being like giving us false expectations in the opposite direction because they've been giving us so many expectations that it was just around the corner. And now they're saying, well, it's a long time away. So maybe, <laughs> maybe they're just trying to temper expectations, which would really make sense for the one year anniversary of Reason 12. Um, but then again, this is also basically them saying that Reason 12 shouldn't have launched in September, which I have also said. Uh, Reason 12 shouldn't have launched until April because they didn't get it up to speed. Um, and that's really frustrating. But we'll save that for another day, unless you want to rage about it in the comments, in which case, go ahead. So those are my thoughts. On the opposite end, though, they've constantly missed the dates that they've predicted for Reason 12's VST3 support. Um, I've constantly moved the goalpost on that. So maybe it's not even going to come out this year. And I could be totally wrong. And this video could just be a total waste of time. These are my two cents. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And I want to let you know that I've got this free Reason cheat sheet that'll help you quickly get up to speed on all the devices in Reason so you can make better music faster. I also think you might enjoy these other videos that are actually about really important topics about Reason instead of this speculation on VST3s.